Hey church, great to see you and so good that you could join me for this uh, devotion. My name's Darren, one of the pastors at Audacious Church Manchester campus and uh, just an absolute privilege for me to bring you this devotion uh, wherever you are, whatever time of the day it is, you have made a great choice during our month of prayer. And I want to talk to you about um, praying for people in your world to know and follow Jesus and just um, encourage us to pursue people so that they see our life, see your life, see my life um, and recognize that there's something different about it. In the Bible, in Romans 10, 14 to 17, in the message, message version, he talks about a grand procession and it says this, but how can people call for help if they don't know who to trust? And how can they know who to trust if they haven't heard of the one who can be trusted? And how can they hear if no one tells them? And how is anyone going to tell them unless someone is sent to do it? This is why the scriptures exclaims, a sight to take your breath away. A grand procession of people telling all the good things that God has done. How amazing is it to be in our dedicated month of prayer? And um, as a church, we've been running the Alpha Course since June 2020. It's been an incredible privilege to see many lives transformed through the power of an encounter with Jesus. We have seen over 300 attend the course, many for the first time, as well as many Christians deepening their faith and relationship with Jesus. One thing that stands out to me is the change that can be seen so evidently in people when they encounter Jesus, realise his love for them, begin to know him deeper and become filled with the Holy Spirit. We've got stories uh, of people going on the Holy Spirit weekend, which is coming soon with Alpha, um, and just encountering the power of the Holy Spirit and um, and just having that, that, that change in their life, one lady filled with the power of the Holy Spirit in the church car park, starting to speak um, in tongues, people being prophesied over uh, and words of knowledge and transformation in a peace. It's absolutely incredible. We have literally seen people transformed, peace given, heaviness lifted, outlook on life changed. It never ceases to amaze me. And I'm always in wonder of how an encounter with Jesus changes everything. You you may know your encounter with Jesus changed your life. It was it was before Jesus and then after Jesus. And you can recount and think about who you were before. And then you met Jesus and, and you had that life-changing moment. And the difference that that has brought, he opens the door to possibilities and opportunities. How from our salvation, we can receive baptism in the Holy Spirit and live an empowered life being continually transformed as we grow deeper in relationship with him. What I would um, just encourage you uh, maybe right now is to pray. Pray today for those on Alpha that their eyes and hearts will be open to Jesus. We've got a course running right now and I'd really encourage you to pray um, at some point in your day for, for those that are on Alpha that their eyes and their hearts will be open to Jesus. Um, just uh, another thought, we are, you and I are a city on a hill, the light of the world. Jesus says that we are the light of the world. We're the head, not the tail, more than conquerors, a masterpiece in the creator's hands. We are his sons and daughters, a grand procession telling of all the good things that he has done, pointing people to Jesus. This is what we can do because of whose we are and who we are. We can live our lives, you and I can live our lives telling people and pointing people to Jesus. As this is our month of prayer, my dare to you is to make your life shine. Pray and ask God to help you do this. And when people see it and ask you what's, what's different about you, grab the opportunity to tell your, tell your story, who you were before Jesus and who you are now, the, the change, the um, the overflow in your in your life, the stories that you've got of being able to lean and trust into Jesus, the, the moments of prayers answered or prayers that are going to be answered, what you're believing for, how he's walked you through the good, the bad, the ugly, the hurts, the hang-ups and the habits, how he walks you through this. Tell them who your Jesus is and the life-changing impact he's had on you. Then invite them to Alpha. Go along with them. Pray and believe for their salvation. As a great speaker once said, let's plunder hell and populate heaven. Pray today for an opportunity to share your 
faith. Alpha is a great opportunity. In fact, it's your opportunity to invite someone to take part in a journey that introduces them to Jesus, the Bible, and a personal relationship with him. I sometimes cannot help but think where my life would be if I hadn't met Jesus, if I hadn't been introduced to him, been shown him. I don't know where, I don't know how I would have navigated life's highs, life's lows, life's hurts, life's pains, life's fears, life's joys. He is truly my saviour, safe refuge, strong tower and prince of peace. Just maybe have a think about this. How would you have navigated life without Jesus? There'll be things that maybe pop up in your mind now, things that you've been through, things that you're going through that you're, you're crying out to Jesus. You've cried out to Jesus and he has stepped in the gap. And that, what we want to encourage you, what I want to encourage you is to think about how your relationship with Jesus has helped you. And then think about how the people in your world who don't know him, how he could help them, how them knowing him, following him, how their lives could be radically changed because of an introduction to him. Alpha has a tagline, friends bring friends. And I would encourage you, almost a dare, for you to think and pray about who you could invite and bring along to the next Alpha Audacious. I'm confident they'll say yes and that they will have a life-changing experience. Alpha is absolutely incredible. Your story is absolutely incredible. The things that Jesus has done in your lives, you are a masterpiece, the head, not the tail. You're his son, you're his daughter. You're incredible, you're amazing. He loves you. He adores you. He has given you everything you need for life and godliness. And oh, one thing that we can do is share that with others. Believe for it. Grab the opportunities. And today also pray for the Alpha team as they take people on a journey of revelation. I'm praying for you, church. I'm praying that you know who you are and whose you are. I'm praying that you um, grab the opportunities today that, that are given to you to share your story with people and praying that your friends, your neighbours, your work colleagues, your family members know and follow Jesus because they see the light in your life. In Jesus' name, amen. Have a great rest of your day, a great week. It's been a pleasure and a privilege to spend this short time with you and I'm praying a blessing on you in Jesus' name. Bye for now, church, and see you soon.